welcome on my channel this is twin flame reading and this is divine masculine messages for divine feminine we're going to see what is truly going on with divine masculine life what they think about you what they feel about you and what is in the next actions and plans toward you whenever you click this video it's gonna resonate with you with your love situation with your twin flame this is timeless we're going to ask God, spirits and angels to guide us, to help us, so we can get accurate answer. No matter are you dealing with men or a woman, you're channeling through them energy. Thanks for to all of you who are subscribing my channel, who supporting me, who liking my videos. I really appreciate all of you. I'm so glad that I can help you, that I can guide you. If you need private reading, you can contact me. Let me see. First card. Card of small money in reversal. And card of fortune in reversal. So your divine masculine is right now unhappy with his situation. With his life. Things not going well, divine feminine. With his job. With his success with his financial situation in generally speaking i'm seeing that he are unhappy right now what else is going on with the mind masculine tower in reversal misfortune in reversal they're trying to find a way how to get out from that problems but they're losing hope. You see, there is card of hope in reversal. They don't want to be in sadness. And they want to get out from all things, negative things. From all lies. From all deceptions. Everything that was in that life. I'm seeing the Divine Masculine trying to get out from that. They haven't go, gone very deeply in lies. In that life where they was, there was so many negative things. And they're not seeing way out from this. They don't see solution. Right now, they have no hope for anything. We're seeing five cards in reversal. Five cards in reversal. This is first time in this spread that we have five cards in reversal. And what we're seeing that this person is very, very unhappy right now. But they regret. They don't know how to get out from that problems. And they don't want to be in sadness they don't want to regret again and again because of all mistakes what they have been done. They want to get out clean from this, but it's look like it's not possible. And what you see here, there is card of loss in reversal beside, again, the same card of fortune in reversal. They don't want to lose themselves. They don't want to lose life. But in the same time, they seeing that, I, that they are unhappy and they saying to themselves that they want to bring that happiness back. And they thinking a lot. Divine feminine. This divine masculine thinking about you a lot. It is your card. I'm so glad that finally this person thinking about you. They are so unhappy without you. They don't want to lose you. They don't know how to bring you back. They don't know how to bring that back, that stability. They don't want to be in regrets. And they want to get out from that ugly life. They know that they are a bad person, that they have bad habits, that they have been manipulating, lying, gossiping. Whatever this person had been done, this person was so deceptive. And they have been in deceptions a very long time. You couldn't trust this person. You see? 
you you have been detached from divine masculine and you also don't want to be in sadness divine feminine you see these two cards it's matching both of these cards are universal so this is what we see here beside you you focusing on detaching from divine masculine because you don't want to be alone in sadness anymore but this divine masculine thinking about you and he is unhappy if he loses you and they are so unhappy because they are far from you because this card of hope bringing this spot and this spot is far away from you they don't want that and what they think about you they thinking that they lost hope that they lost chance with you they thinking that they should speak truth with you that they should recover but they have been broke because this tower is universal this divine masculine seeing truth they're gonna get that enlightenment they're gonna get that light what they have been looking for but they don't seeing right now way out but it will be there because this is card of god eye this is card of world this is card of universe this is card of sun whatever they think in whatever condition they are right now even if they are in worse situation right now there is god protecting them and protecting you divine feminine god will not allow them to think negative about you you see even if this person is in this tower and they lost hope for you for them we have this card in reversal here and this is very good and it's good because we got these two cards in reversal and this is very two ugly cards so that's good because divine masculine is seeing right now where they have been made mistakes and they seeing that it's not possible to fix that mistakes they're losing hope for you but there is god i something will happen not from them side not from your side it's gonna happen from god from divine timing divine feminine this is what will happen If God seeing that they truly regret, then God will step out there. You see what they feel for you. They have been feel that negative feelings toward you. Look you as enemy. But right now this card is in reversal. Why? Because that negative feelings, what was in them heart, that negative feelings will fade away now they changing that that energy is changing in divine masculine heart and why divine feminine because you detaching from divine masculine because you're not disturbing them anymore because you're not chasing them anymore now that energy you shifting on a smart way toward divine masculine and this is what is result from that there have been somebody there have been somebody watching on the side somebody who, who have been stopping this union for two of you to be together to communicate to marry to have family but that person maybe was wrong because that person now seeing that you have been loyal that you have been respecting divine masculine loving divine masculine for real that person couldn't see truth and also you divine could divine feminine you couldn't see truth but you will get that truth you will see that Let me see. What divine masculine feel for you? What 
can I mask and feel for you? What did I mask and feel for you? Be patient, Divine Feminine. Sometimes card, cards need more time for shuffling. We got so many cards. Should we read all this? One, two, three, four, five, six cards. Is it more? Divine Feminine, something is connected with this card. It's Seven of Swords. So we're going to read all that. And why this card is reversal here, this card of thief, this card of the scammer, this card of shadow, this is card of covert. This person now want to reveal them truth, who they truly are, and they want to get out from that negative energy. They want to get out from third party situation. They want to be clean. They want to be loyal. This is what's going on in them heart. They changing them heart what they feel toward you, divine feminine. And that is positive because this card coming after this card of enemy in reversal. So this person, your twin flame, your divine masculine. They want to change themselves. They want to change themselves completely. So let me see what is connected with this card. You see, they don't want to be in arguments. They don't want to be in negative energy with you. They don't want to be in breakup with you. They don't want to be in silence with you. This person don't want to reach out first toward you, but in same time they don't want to act like that anymore, to think like this anymore. They thinking that they should make some steps, but they don't allowing that to themselves. But in same time, we seeing that something. You know, something is changing here. They they changing perspective, the way they seeing things, the way they feel about you. So let me put that card here. We're gonna put these cards back. Why they what they feel about two of you, about that closure, about that union. Everything is changing now. You see, this is a neutral position. This is card of house. Let me put this in upright position. Because what we see here, that this person is in sadness. And they couldn't tell you where they are, where they live, who you are to them, for real. Maybe they have been lying to you that you are their family, that they're going to build a family with you, that they're going to build a house with you, that they're going to start life with you. But they, in fact, want that. This person truly want that. And why? Because this person want to marry you. This person want to talk to you. There is God. So I'm going to put these three cards here, Divine Feminine. I feel I should put these three cards here. Because this is what they want. This is what this person want. You see this Divine Feminine? This person have true feelings for you. And they regretting for all lies. Why they have been told you. Firstly they have been mad. Then they have been done some wrong things. Because they just wanted to make some reaction, to disturb you, to provoke you. But now you see this person 
want to change themselves because they lost hope. They lost, they lost hope about them life, where they're standing, what they have, even about their memories. Everything is mixed. And this person don't want to be alone anymore. And this person don't want to live in lies, in deceptions anymore. This person know that they have been lost you. And they don't want to lose you. And they know that they was not right. That they was wrong. They was wrong. They know about that. There was, they was not fair toward you. There was no justice toward you. This person had been done so many things. Wrong things. And why? Because this person have no rules. This person have... They never was truly regret for anything before. This person was doing always everything against of rules. Whatever it is honor, they always was, was stepping on that. They have been confronting to everything, doing opposite. Let me see. What is in the next steps toward you, actions, plans? Wow. You see this? This person, you know, have feelings for you and they want happiness. They want in fact, what I'm getting, they saying, I just want somebody to truly love me, to make me happy, and I don't want to lose somebody. And I feel I should bring these cards back. I should bring these cards back in the deck and shuffle again. Because these three cards fell here. And Divine Masculine want to say right now that they just want somebody to love them, somebody to make them happy to don't lose somebody i mean this is kind of selfish right like uh, this person done so many bad things and now this person regretting for that and now they want somebody you know who will be there and never leave but they gonna see that truth that you know you didn't love divine feminine because you don't love them you love them because of that who they are, the way they have been treat you, the way they have been done some things, betraying you, cheating on you, lying on you, fooling on you, scamming on you. This is why you have been left. They can't just say, I want somebody to love me and, and I don't want to lose somebody. They cannot say like that. It's just like a like person who is still like a child who don't see things and speak like that. Like they can find anybody to love them and they can keep act the way they act. That's not that's not what they want. They just sound like that, like a child. But they're gonna see that truth and this person will become stable and clean toward you you see in front of you in front of your sadness you're not gonna make steps you're not gonna go back to this person you're waiting them to do something officially and let me see what is in that next steps and actions and plans toward you let me see Let me see Divine Feminine. We're going to ask God, spirits and angels to guide us, to help us, to give us a great answer. Please be patient. Shuffling is going very slow. Wow. 
igual. Let me see. In neutral position, something about money, something about financial situation. This card fell here. Okay, this person want. I'm still hearing, I want somebody to love me. I, I don't want to cheat. I don't want to play around. I don't want to be somebody else. I don't want to be in deceptions. This is what I'm hearing. And what I'm hearing also, the Divine Masculine wants somebody who is honest, loyal, pure. They, they want, you know, true love. True love from somebody. And we keep getting these two cards here. Okay? And there is this. You, you who standing with loyalty. And they have been turned back to you. They didn't look that. They, they was ignoring that. And they have been admired to something else. To something what they have been appreciating. Divine Feminine. What is in the next actions and plans over you? We're going to clarify these two cards here. Wow, this is a lot. I can't take all this. I can't take all this. This person in the next actions and plans, they want to be happy. They want to be successful. They want to bring some justice. They want to communicate. But this is in neutral position, Divine Feminine. They swell here. They want to speak from the heart. They want to say honestly what they feel and what they believe. And what you see in here, there it is. Loyalty. Cross. You, Divine Feminine. And there is many cards what is connected with you. There is a lot of baggage on you, Divine Feminine. All these cards is connected with you. And we have card of jealousy. Because you know, you know, that this Divine Masculine have been between two options, three options. You was not on the first place. But look, now your card is in the middle. One, two, three. Card number three is in the middle. Let me see this. What this card's gonna say? You don't want to be in misfortune also. You don't want to have financial problems also. You want to solve some things. Maybe you have to go to hospital. Maybe you have to solve some problems with some bills, some legal things. Whatever problems you have, you want to solve that. You also need financial support. And what we see here is that you don't want to be in arguings. And you don't want to expect anything. If this person can be clean, if this person can truly love you, then they have to show you. But if they gonna make you just sad and lonely, then they just should, you know, continue with that journey wherever they want to go. So you have, you know, this baggage and you want to let go of that. Like you still have that baggage holding Divine Feminine, all these cards fell with you. You can be in love to Sagittarius or what I'm seeing here, Gemini. And you don't want materialistic person in your life. I mean, if this Divine Masculine come back to you, showing loyalty to you, then you're going to say to them, 
you're gonna speak up you're gonna open up divine feminine you're gonna say that you don't want any problems with them anymore you don't want them to go in that wrong direction where they're gonna just make you mad make you sad you don't want that you don't want arguments you don't want fights with them you don't want them because of money you don't want two of you to fight because of money because of success because of stability you don't want these things you don't want any materialistic reasons for fights any topics about that you don't want anymore you want to avoid all that and from them you just want them to say to you honestly who they are what they want and what is them attentions and this person can come clean toward you to love you truly you accepting them because you have been gone through a lot of sadness through a lot of suffering and you want to move away from that you don't want to stay there this is what you're gonna say to divine feminine to divine masculine this is what you're gonna say and for some of you you're gonna become that runner you're gonna become that you know you're gonna pick that energy from divine masculine i mean that that uh, energy about running and chasing it can be also something that you can apply to divine masculine or to divine feminine you know it's not only divine masculine runner divine feminine also can be runner and divine masculine also can become chaser This is, you know, some other things. Maybe I'm going to explain this in my next videos. If you want to know about that, about how this twin flame connection is working and what is divine masculine for real and what is divine feminine for real, who are the twin flames. So you can understand better how all this is going about this journey, twin flame journey. And we're going to see from these cards that you're not going to be anymore that naive person who just giving loyalty, who are waiting their divine feminine. You're going to say honestly where you're standing and what you're expecting. Because you have no time for this. You have no time for BS. You have no time to watch this. To watch divine masculine with somebody else or then to watch you with somebody else you don't want to go through that things them to make you jealous to fooling you or whatever games they playing you don't want to go through that let me see two cards more two cards more What is in the next actions and plans toward you? You see, union, happiness, divine feminine. Celebration, it's coming. It will be there. It will be the way you want. And many things will be over and you're going to celebrate because of that. Something going to be over. Something it's done after your words everything will be done the things gonna be over that ugliest things and they're coming union between two of you divine feminine one card more one card more let me see one card more wow some cards fell down you're not gonna pick that cards you see the card of love is in upright position two cards fell down so let me see what divine mask I'm gonna release what two of you gonna release you see jealousy cheating third party situation karmic situations that thing's gonna be over they're releasing themselves from that and if they have been 
thinking something wrong that you are with somebody else they're gonna release themselves from thinking wrong about you because you never have been cheated on them you never have been done these things to them they're gonna release themselves from that one card we need one card okay let me see you see your sadness will be over divine feminine for some of you because you're gonna get child congratulations baby is on the way for others of you when two of you come back to union you're not gonna be lonely anymore so this card of loneliness you got in reversal and you're gonna start family you're gonna start family because this divine masculine coming with true love they're gonna come clean toward you with clear attentions they're gonna maybe offer you something you see there is card of gift it can be engagement and for others of you they when they come back two of you gonna get child right away this is what will happen this is gift from god this is what will happen so clearly be seeing you gonna get child and that is the biggest gift This person not gonna look on money anymore, on that big money, but you know, was only stressing them. This person gonna look in direction of this love, true love, what they feel for you. Especially if you're dealing with Sagittarius, fire sign, Pisces, Gemini, Leo, Aries, Taurus. Your person can be in military, in police, they can work for government, or they was in some legal issues, legal problems, but they're going to solve that. All other things are unimportant for them. Nothing else is important, divine feminine. Nothing else. Now, let me clarify these two cards here, okay? You see, if two of you have been arguing because of somebody, you know, the things still going to be there. Still, two of you going to discuss about somebody. Still, there will be fights about that. The Divine Masculine don't want to leave that life. They don't want to be between two partners. They don't want to cheat around. But two of you going to discuss about these things. And arguing about that. But your sleepless night's gonna be over because of that divine family. It's gonna be over. Because two of you are gonna move forward and things gonna transform. You know, you're gonna start something new. You see? Something new gonna be born. Something will be something will came to the end. And that is the old way of life. It's coming to the end. You're going to move forward, Divine Feminine. That, that is what will happen. And look, there will be love. After this, you know, jealousy, doubts, you will get true love. I'm going to clarify this card of widow universal why your loneliness will be over you see because there will be love because this person love you because this divine masculine you see how they standing with you they don't want you to be sad and they want to love you they want to give you the true love and from your side divine feminine there is you there is loyalty and there is your happiness and there is divine masculine happiness you are in the middle of the reading so this is very powerful and beautiful you know you you still gonna be jealous you still gonna be in doubts 
I have to tell you true. But something will be over, you know. Something will be over. The deck, the deck is closed, so we can't watch this. We only see that something will be over. Whatever it is. If you have been doubting the Divine Masculine, you have a child with somebody else. That was rumor. That was not true. Okay? So now let me see with Tarot cards what Tarot will say to you. What Divine Masculine think about you. Divine Masculine think about you. We need one card. Okay, we got three cards. Okay. So let me see. They have been left you. And they think you have been left this relationship. But this, but this Divine Masculine truly love you. King of Cups. They want to remove these daggers from your heart. They know that they have been broke your heart. They know that they have been hurt you. This person had been left everything. But they still love you. And they thinking about their feelings. Not this person. Thinking about them feelings, about them heart. So now they think from heart, not from their minds, not from them ego. And this person, your divine masculine, your twin flame, coming back with communication toward you. And they don't care, are you mad, are you in ego? They don't care that they're going to break all rules. What they feel for you, something... Fell down, let me see. Four of swords in reversal. This person still need time to rest. This is what I'm hearing. They still need time to rest. Let me see what they feel for you, Divine Family. Divine Masculine feel for you. Wow, we got some cards here. Look, oh my God, oh my God, Divine Feminine. How are you going to put these cards? How are you going to put these cards? This person truly regret for leaving you. This person truly is sad because you also love them. For some of you, Divine Feminine, you have been made decision to leave Divine Masculine because they have been left you. If they have been detached themselves from you, you also done the same. And this person don't know what to do. They want second chance with you. They want to be with you. They hoping that you are you that you're gonna offer this cup of love to them. That you're gonna offer them second chance. They want you so badly to go back to them, to chase them, to communicate to communicate with them, to call them. But this is what they will do, actually. This is why they can sleep in the nights. Because this person want to do all these things from their heart. This person going to go back to you. We have again fire sign, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. We have here Knight of Wands. This person going to make actions. So... When they will do this, in the moments when they are desperate, maybe somebody going to offer them to drink, to say, don't be sad, don't be sad, I give you to drink. But then when they drunk, they're going to do some things, you know, you're going to be surprised, they're going to call you, they're going to come back to you, they're going to run toward you, they're going to propose you, they're going to engage with you. This person going to do so many things, like, like, this person is crazy, madly in love to you. This Divine Masculine here. We have Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords, you know. So, what we have here is Water Sign, any Water Sign or any Air Sign also. This is very strong. So, expect from your Air Sign or Water Sign... But now they're going to make some actions toward you. This person don't want to be selfish anymore. 
they don't care now anything anymore and they because they couldn't see that they couldn't see these two two of cups behind of them you see there is five of cups and this card was behind like this you see so we couldn't see that but standing behind they couldn't see that but there is love and this person don't want anymore to be selfish to be egoistic to be independent like they just want to enjoy in them life alone free and selfish they don't want that so we have pisces here gemini leo so this your person can be attracted toward you because you have water sign because you have fire sign or air sign in your astrological chart and this is what they respect from you because mentally they have been attached to you you know they have been found that match when two of you speaking the topics what two of you had together that was make them happy only with you they have been connecting themselves mentally and emotionally also they didn't connect themselves with you because of coins because of pentacles this person have no any materialistic attention toward you this is pure love but you are in the in regress divine feminine and what we seeing is seeing also that this person is truly regretting for everything what they have been done the tower in reversal you see this same same like here tower is in reversal so this person want to make things right i know they have been lost hope but this is what will happen okay divine feminine let me see what is in the next actions and plans toward you you see this card of hermit is in neutral position they still not ready to talk to you there's still silence between two of you but this person gonna get out from that what is in the next actions and plans toward you? Wow. How we can take this? There is too many cards, Divine Feminine. Too many cards. They don't want to lose you. They need more time. You know, and, and they want to bring you back. You know, this person can do now anything to give you, but because they need more time okay we're gonna shuffle again we're gonna shuffle again yes they they don't know what to do this person don't know what to decide but they gonna do it they're just now between they thinking should they make that step? Should they make decision? Will they make a wrong choice? Wrong step? Let me see what is in the next actions and plans toward you. This person don't want to make you sad. They're still not ready to commit. Because they have no work because they have nothing to give you they have they can provide for this union for this relationship what they have with you so they cannot marry right now to you I mean they want to engage with you but right now they can do that I mean they cannot marry you officially right now because there is a lot of things what they need and right now they can't provide anything
but this person gonna fight for it until they make something until they make some pentacles until they they find something stable in them like you see some contracts with some people right now they are unstable king of pentacles in reversal let me clarify all this let me clarify yes they they can have right now that what you need you see this person not gonna give up this is in neutral position but right now they they feel tired the Sagittarius or Capricorn or Virgo. They can't give anything right now, but they have attention to do that. You see this Divine Feminine? What's standing there? You know, this is your card. You have been patient. You are this Queen of Pentacles. They want you to become them wife. They want you to become them husband, wife, partner for life. And, you know, they... For some of them, they ex expecting from you some type of support, some type of investment, but don't give. But don't give anything, divine feminine. You have to see this person to offer you this new beginning. You can give them support. You can give them answer yes, but something will be will be there between two of you. You see, Ace of Pentacles watching in direction of this Ace of Wands. So something will be between two of you. Two of you will find some solution to solve things. Maybe they're going to start new beginning. Maybe two of you going to open business together. Something will happen here. Two of you will start new life together with passion. And there will be some success, financial success for two of you. This person have been walked away from you. They didn't offer you anything before. But you see, card of temperance, angels working on this. Angels working on that two of cups, what they couldn't see. It is invisible, but they feel it. They feel that these two of cups will be together. This is what will happen, Divine Feminine. I'm going to take another tarot card to clarify all this for you. So let me see what we will get, Divine Family. What we will get here. We need one card. Heart Priests. Chariot in Reversal. Card of Road. Yes, like I said, they are not able to offer you something right now. They may be not be able to come to you right now, but they're going to offer you a new beginning, life together, wherever they are. Maybe you're going to say that you're going to weigh them, that you can go back to them, that there's still big distance between two of you. But even if there is big distance between two of you, they're going to offer you, you know, life together, new beginning together. This is, you see this card of higher priestess where he felt here. So these three cards is connected with you. This is same person, this queen of pentacles, earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. This card of empress. Leo, Cancer, Taurus, Libra. This this person can be you, and this is your qualities. It, it is who you are. You're beautiful. You're patient. You you have that awakening. You're this high priestess. You know everything. You feel everything. You understand everything. You have compassion. You are empath. You're psychic, your mother, you're everything. 
there's nothing better than this connecting these three cards together but the only thing this queen of pentacles in is in reversal because you're unstable maybe your financial situ situation is not well but you are aware of your beauty you are aware of your talents you have so many talents and skills divine feminine and maybe you're gonna offer them something to prove you to show you that they deserve you even this person can go back to you no matter where they are they want to start new beginning with you maybe they're gonna send you ticket you know for some of you you're gonna get ticket you're gonna travel to another country And whatever you offer to this person, this person gonna also offer to you. Your twin flame can offer to you. Also, this card can be connected with money, with some support. I'm seeing that two of you gonna start something new, something good. Investing to each other and having passion and having new life. You are everything to this person, you are world to this person. Even if they can give you right now something. Even if they can go back right now to you. Let's see. Let me clarify this. Nine of Cups. They want harmony. They want happiness with you. There will be. Happiness. Wish will come through divine feminine. You see, temperance again. Temperance is working on this relationship. So what do you have? Nine cups here. Plus two. Eleven cups. So that's the number. That's the number. Number eleven. And what you're seeing here? Number eleven. Number two. So Divine Feminine, if you're seeing these numbers, this can be reading for you. If you're seeing 11 and 11, this can be answer for you. This Divine Masculine want to be with you. You see this? This temperance is working on your connection. No matter where you are, where they are, two of you are not going to be separated. You see, there is again Five of Cups. There is Five of Cups. sadness but you have ace of cups with fire angels not allowing this relationship to be ended there is deep feelings there is deep connection you see there is moon there is moon and there is moon also divine feminine this is deep connection and this person who have been ghosting you who have been keeping you in no contact they're gonna get out from that they're still gonna hide themselves but at least they're gonna get out from that no contact because they have deep feelings toward you you know this person can be scorpio sagittarius or capricorn this is what i'm seeing here or even pisces they they, they can be scared to talk to you some of them they have been hide themselves somewhere you couldn't find them on social media you couldn't find them new phone number nothing about them but this person gonna get out from that hermit because they have feelings toward you divine feminine and because this person want to protect what they have with you because they know that you have been waiting on them and this person want to go back to you because this person missing your care they remembering of times but they know they know they didn't came to you they didn't apologize to you and they know that if they don't apologize if they don't come to you they know they're gonna lose your care this person coming back you see this you see how these two cards is connected, Divine Feminine? You see this? You see this? You're standing there watching. 
in this direction, this person coming so happy toward you, they're running on this horse, fire sign, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Like I said, there can be Pisces, but Pisces, that's Scorpio, they scared so much, but this person coming back to protect everything, maybe you're gonna act protective in front of them you will not give them to conquer you but this person regretting for leaving you because of others they have been influenced from others this person gonna offer you something you know and something two of you will plan together planning together this is what i'm seeing divine feminine look what you have here you have your empress here and you have ace of pentacles again divine feminine this is so beautiful and nice this is what you will be and you're gonna write about that some of you gonna write about it two of you gonna make something together for some of you i'm seeing business or two of you starting to make plans together finally first time for two of you it's gonna happen the two of you gonna sit and write something planning something together this is for some of you for others of you you're getting offered to be married you're getting offered to be together with divine masculine because you are ruling with them feelings with them heart you see behind this empress there is car there is moon and there is moon. This person gonna get out from that hermit mode because they gonna do that from the feelings. Divine feminine. Okay, let me see what we have from Romans Angels Oracle deck. Is there any advice for you? What they say, new love in neutral position. So you met somebody else? You met somebody else? Did they met somebody else? I don't think so. Even if they did, you know, they're going to call you. You see, calling in your soulmate. They're going to call you. Wow, we have some cards here. Worth waiting for. Some of you are impatient. You can't wait, Divine Feminine. You can wait for them. So you want new love? Or maybe some of them want new love because they are impatient. Oh my God. They're releasing themselves from something. Okay, okay. Let me see. Release your ex. Romantic feelings. Let your friends help you. Wedding. Okay. So if this person have been planning to marry somebody else, they're releasing themselves from that. Let your friends help you. If they have been codependent and, and depend only from what friends thinking, if they have been influenced from friends, they're going to release themselves from that. You know, they're not going to release themselves from X. So if you have been break up with them and if you officially X to your divine masculine, they're not going to release themselves from you. And if you think that they have some romantic feelings towards somebody else, they don't have. They don't have. You see, flirt. This person not going to flirt with somebody new. There will be no new love for Divine Masculine. But they say, getting to know each other. They don't need to know you better. To know that you... Are the right one they feel it from that moon but they saw already let me take more cards what romans angels gonna advise you what will happen there we need one card Wow, got three cards. I think it's three. Calling in your soulmate, so expect there will be phone call. Divine Feminine. 
stay optimistic about your love life yes when you least expect you know when you giving up that's the moment when they're gonna call you this could be the one you know you don't trust that this person is the one financial and uh, you know financial situation will be still problem there like i said they will not be able to offer you something they still have to solve that but look deception is going to be over and this is very important because we got this card in reversal i'm so happy for you because you will at least know where you're standing they maybe will not be able to offer you this and that but this person want to be with you and you know this person have to solve that things you know they're gonna find some way how to make new contracts new job whatever this is you know but you will know the truth this person not gonna be deceptive anymore this deception is not gonna be there between two of you this person want to come clean toward you and look there will come two conversation between two of you you see this okay divine feminine so let me see now what i'm gonna take i'm gonna take another cards for you wow we got something we got something you got jack of diamonds sagittarius aries leo taurus capricorn virgo number 12 and 12 number three number six so what i'm seeing here that this person you know still can't be you know flirting and and having fun with others but what we see here that these deceptions will be over that this will be over so this is why we got this card after this card together that what you seeing you don't need to uh, panic or to be scared because this thing's gonna be over this thing's gonna be over divine feminine this is what i'm seeing let me take one more card number 13 number six what i'm seeing here number six and four and four eight eight and six fourteen five divine feminine divine feminine this divine masculine gonna leave that people we saw that five of swords right so if they have been met some people and these people have been influencing on them this person gonna lead that people this is what will happen they're gonna leave that people because of you they don't care anymore anything and who gonna leave this fire sign sagittarius aries leo or taurus capricorn virgo and why they're gonna leave because they want to be alone 10 and 10 if you seeing these numbers this can be answer for you that person is alone they thinking about all things alone they are in solitude you see this in hermit this is what it is divine family and when they get out from that they're gonna speak to some people publicly they're gonna say some things number 20 number 20 if you sing number eight and eight or if you sing number four this can be reading for you or if you sing number two and two but what we seeing that this person gonna think very carefully about everything divine family okay they're gonna think very carefully you're gonna think very carefully about another person 
if they met somebody else. They're going to think if they communicating with somebody else, what they're going to say, what they're going to say to you. Because this person wants to be with you in union. And because this person want more than that. They're going to give you some gift. You see this? They want reconciliation. This person not going to be interested in this person. They're going to be interested to speak with somebody else about you. Because this is you. This is union with you. This is what will happen. Let me check something, Divine Feminine. Let me check. My energy is a little bit slow, but I hope I'm going to deliver you good, strong messages. Yes, you see, this person going to find match for themselves, somebody else. They're going to leave everything. They're going to be with some friends. Like I told you, they're going to be with many other people. They're going to make some decisions. They're going to talk with several people about you. About them decisions. Let me see with another playing cards. You see this? Jack of Diamonds. Again, same card for you. You see this? You see this, Divine Feminine? Oh my God. This is what this person wants. It's the same card. They want to invest themselves in relationship and they want to prepare themselves for something bigger than relationship. This person is on the journey. But they're going to go back to you. You see this? Because this person wants this with you. We sing pair here. This person wants pair. Okay? So let me clarify this card here. Somebody can be against of marriage, Divine Feminine. Somebody can be against. But now I'm going to clarify about this person. Who is this person? Is Divine Masculine has some feelings for that person? Wow, this card was flied so fast. Jump in there very fast. Look, Divine Feminine. If this is some another option, if they have another option, they're going to think very carefully about that. And that is something what somebody may be offering them for better life. But I'm not seeing that Divine Masculine is going to choose that person. Let me clarify this. Let me clarify this. There will be something officially. Something officially. And you know, you will know about that. You will know about that. This can be mother, this can be family. This is what I'm seeing, Divine Feminine. This is what I'm seeing for you. This is what I'm seeing. Let me check one more time. Let me check one more time. I'm going to put all these cards here on the side. Be focused on this, what I'm going to do now. So I'm going to clarify which card will be on Divine Masculine. This card or this. I'm seeing that they're choosing this pair. There's no doubts about that. But I'm going to clarify this to see. Okay. Let me see. Let me see where you're standing. You're standing here. Okay. Let me see what is on your side. What is on your side, Divine Feminine? You have too many worries. You're thinking that they're choosing somebody else. You see this card? This card is also on your side. So it is about you. This Divine Masculine have been thinking wrong about you. And they will clear, clear things with you. Because they have been in negative energy, thinking wrong. 
they wasn't ready they was unsure where they standing with you divine feminine let me see gonna move these cards on the side let me see what's going on there I'm gonna move also these cards on the side let me see what's going on there no no this somebody else with, with somebody else this is what is in divine masculine heart only them and to move somewhere with this six of space with you i'm gonna clarify this for you divine family let me see This can be a little bit boring boring but please be patient because i'm gonna get some very important answer for you here divine family yes they they worry about what will happen in this situation you see they're watching on you, they're watching somewhere else, they're trying to figure out what will what will they do about them life. Let me see. This is your card, you see this? This card want to fall here, okay you come to completion divine feminine they worry about the future they want to move somewhere where they can build better future it can be that they are between two persons You know whatever it was if they have been connected with family if they have been struggling with them family you know this person gonna you know whatever there there was whatever was effect on them to feel the way they feel you know this person had been very hurt from them family and you know this is why this is why they have been lying to you a lot, pretending, keep you on the side, because this person have trauma from the family, from the father. This is what I'm getting here from somebody who is very important in family. You see this? Somebody was investing in third party situation, in karmic situation, and it was affect on them a lot. This is why this person have a lot of trauma in life. And there is broken heart. They have been broke your heart. They have been done same things what they have been saw from them family, from mother and father. The remembering of the things. This person standing alone, they are alone, they will have open heart to receive love, but now they're just thinking about you and they still have some negative thoughts, but we saw that this person going to release that negative thinking that I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you that divine feminine. There you go. You see, they're going to release all that negative, whatever they think about you. It 
it is still there you see this they're still they're still holding that that swords in them hard they still know that they have been hurt you and still they have some negative feelings they're still dealing with that but these two cards is there you see i got these two cards and it is it can be connected with you they can feel your negative energy this can be only reason divine feminine only but we got too many strong things this and this you see this these three cards and something will come officially there i'm gonna clarify this for you and I'm going to bring this card back in the deck to see where this card going to stand, okay? Will they choose still to have doubts on you? To choose third-party situation? Will they choose you? Or will they stay in this broken heart? Keep breaking your heart? I mean, they're not going to choose anybody else, but they're going to find a way how to break in your heart. Because we see that this person want to be with you, but still this person are in negative energy. So I'm going to put this card here. I'm going to shuffle. Let me see what we'll get. Let me see what we will get. Divine Feminine. Okay. Wow, they're choosing you. They're choosing you, Divine Feminine. They're choosing you. You see this? They want to invest everything in you because they lost. They, they feel regret because they have been lose you. They want to move forward in calm waters. In better life with you. They're going to be serious with you. Because this person was not ready they don't know where they're standing, but this is what they want. And they go, they're going to say to another person that they are in relationship. You know, that they ending everything with others. They're ending everything with others. They're going to say that they are in relationship, that they was not ready, but then... They made that decision to be in relationship with you. And there will come happiness to two of you, Divine Feminine. Happiness. And what we see, three of hearts here. Three of hearts. And what we see here, three of space, three of swords here, that they will not make you sad anymore this person want to build future they're gonna leave other people you know even that other people gonna be disappointed about them this person want to fight for two of you for two of you to be in happiness and and this person want to be you know good husband good father they don't want to be you know person who will break your heart and if there have been somebody else, that somebody else will have husband and child, this person not going to interfere your life, whoever this person is. Happiness is coming toward you and to, to Divine Masculine. This is what will happen, Divine Feminine. They will come to this conversation because this person will let go of this four of hearts, of that self-pity, regret, whatever they have been done. They're choosing you. They're not choosing three of cups. They're not choosing three of hearts. They're choosing to become serious toward you, Divine Family. This is what I'm getting here, okay? Let me see now what messages you will get from these handmade messages. What Divine Masculine want to say to you? Wow. 
I will call you. I will call you. Divine Feminine. Your Divine Masculine going to call you. So be prepared on this phone call. I am sorry. They say they are sorry. I am in love to you. I didn't touch anyone else. I was not honest. I love you. So if this person was not honest to you, they're going to be honest to you about them attentions, about them feelings. You're going to know things. You're going to get everything officially with this person. They're going to remove that negative thinking about you. This person going to be with you. And the most important here that they're going to call you. So Divine Feminine, if you are in no contact, if you are in silence, if you're not making any actions toward Divine Masculine, if you're not chasing, if you're not initiating any conversation, just be patient. This person going to call you. They say, I'm sorry. I'm in love to you. I didn't touch anyone else. You know? I was not honest. Maybe they was not honest that they didn't touch anyone else, but they love you. Maybe they was not honest because maybe they have been made you jealous because we got that card of jealousy. Maybe they have been pretending that they have somebody else. You know, whatever they have been done, you know, they was not honest about that. They say that they love you. You see this? So this person going to call you. This is very important. They say they're sorry that they love you. So congratulations, Divine Feminine. I hope you like this reading, that this reading is going to bring you some clarity and some good guidance. Be in your power. Stay calm. Don't be sad. Believe this is going to happen. This Divine Masculine is going to call you because we have confirmation calling in your soulmate. You see this, Divine Feminine? This person is going to call you. And this is what will happen. There is your card. You know, no matter even this Divine Masculine thinking wrong about you right now, but now, you know, you gave them space and time so they can think about you, so they can miss you, so they can feel sorry, so they can express to you true love. It's going to happen. This person going to call you. So Divine Feminine, be prepared on this phone call and let me know in the comments when your Divine Masculine contact you. I will be so glad to hear from you. Thank you very much for watching this video. Thank you for liking, for subscribing my channel. And don't forget to click that notification bell to get my new videos whenever I'm posting. See you next time. Bye.